Today we're checking out the Easy Mount VBT200 and originally it was up to 100 inch TVs, now we're increasing that to 115 inch TVs with the new TCL. You get the usual four parts, so you get the manual, the wall plate, the arms and the accessories. I don't think anyone would be using that template to be honest. Checking the manual, you've got all the parts, so you've got the wall mounts here. They're actually quite large wall mounts, which is good because it's made for big TVs. And then you have the mounting for the TV, and it looks like we have the right sizes there. Because of some potential painting issues, you'll notice that the tilt pattern might be slightly different, but they're both the same thing. Being a really long wall plate, it's quite heavy. The thing about tilts is that most of the cost of the tilt is actually in the arms, and these are quite substantial. So it has spring clips which work well. As far as thickness, I measured 2.3mm on the wall plate and 2.1mm on the arms, which is quite thick. And the length is over a metre. That's important because the TCL is one metre wide, the VESA. The arms, 830mm long. So the longest ones tend to be about 600mm. So 830 gives you a little bit of extra headroom. For today on the testing board, we'll mount it to 800 by 600. One drawback of large tilt brackets is they have to sit a long way from the wall so that the bottom of the TV doesn't hit the wall. This one measured 136 mil from the wall. It should tilt up 15 degrees. We got 14 degrees, which is okay. And tilting down 16 degrees. So probably tilting down is the important one. Having extra space also gives you access to things like the quick release. The testing board is about the equivalent height of a 65 inch and we know a 65 inch TV tends to have about 200 mil distance between the bottom VESA and the bottom of the TV. So in this case we've got about 260 mil and about the worst TV is an 86. Uh, there are about 250 mil between the bottom VESA and bottom of the TV. As you go bigger to a 98 inch it's only 170 mil because their VESAs tend to be mounted lower down. So while this bracket looks like it's a long way off the wall, it's about the shortest distance that you can allow if you want to support all TV sizes. But some people want a 1.14 meter wall plate, but they only need it flat against the wall. So what options do we have? Of the vertical arms on fixed mounts, the only one that seemed to work was the VPF 80. We still have three problems. The security bar should be wider. I'd like the vertical to be 600 mil to count for all TVs and it should be lower profile ideally. With the VESA being potentially so wide, you'd also want a micro adjustment. The problem is with big TVs, getting access to that micro adjustment Allen key is difficult. So you'd probably like that screw to be really long so that you can reach over the top of the TV and get access to the micro adjustment. So in summary, it's not an ideal fixed bracket as it is, but as a tilt bracket, it's the first one that I've seen that will support that TCL 115 inch. And the fact that it sits a long way off the wall allows it to tilt, which is really necessary. So a great bracket as a tilt bracket for extra large TVs.